Hey, I'm JR, training manager here at Crutchfield, and in today's video, we're gonna be talking about the new Alpine R2 dual voice coil subwoofers. The model numbers make sense. R2, because that's the new series of R series subs. W for woofer, the size comes next, either eight, 10 or 12, D for dual voice coil, and then there's either a two or a four on the end of that model number, so you know if it's a dual two ohm or a dual four ohm voice coil. All of the subs use a Kevlar reinforced pulp woofer cone, which means they sound warm and musical thanks to the pulp or paper, and they're nice and durable and can handle lots of power thanks to the Kevlar. The woofer cone is attached to the basket using Alpine's HAMR or hammer rubber surround, so it's also good and durable and allows that woofer to move in and out freely. The motor structure is redesigned and uses double stacked magnets so it can handle tons of power. These subs are made to go in either small sealed or ported boxes. Let's talk specs for a second. The eight inch can go all the way down to 30 Hertz and handles 350 Watts and has a sensitivity rating of 83.6. The 10 inch can play down to 26 Hertz and handles 750 Watts at a 82.3 sensitivity. And the 12 inch can go all the way down to 24 Hertz also handles 750 watts and has a sensitivity of 85. Those sensitivity ratings tell us that these subs are looking for power. Give them all the power they can handle. We recommend as close to 100% of the maximum RMS that these subs will handle. In fact, they're a really good match for the Alpine RA75M, which is a mono sub amp that puts out 750 watts at two ohms. So if you're just getting one sub, like say the 10 or the 12, that one amp will be perfect. Get the dual four ohm voice coil models, wire them in parallel, and you'll have 750 watts pushing these subs to their max. If you're gonna get two of these subs, you should probably get two of those amps. These subs replace Alpine's previous R series subs. That's why they are the R2s. And reviews are already coming in on these subs. I'd like to read a few of them for you. Uh, a customer from Eureka, California has the eight inch and he says, they outperform a couple different single tens I have tried. Accurate, loud, more excursion than I thought. Usual Alpine quality and true to the advertised ratings. Race from Auburn, Washington has the 10 inch and he says, I replaced my last model Type R with these new ones. This new model is outstanding. I was blown away with its increased range, clarity, smoothness, and power compared to the last model. And Daniel from Coral Springs, Florida has the 12 inch. And he says, rich and boomy lows while still maintaining tight and punchy mid bass. Currently running these on 1200 watts RMS in a ported under seat enclosure. I highly recommend the new Type R's and I highly recommend getting them from Crutchfield. Couldn't agree with you more, Daniel. So if you have any questions on these new Alpine Type R2 subwoofers, get in touch with us here at Crutchfield. Go to crutchfield.com slash contact. You'll be able to talk live with our advisors either over the phone or you can chat with them online. You can also post your questions right here on this YouTube video. We do look at those comments and we will respond accordingly. Uh, and as always, like, subscribe, and turn on those notifications. And thanks for watching.